Hey Blue Table fans, bah, another year of this operation is happening. So, uh, happy New Year's Eve and happy New Year. I've got a lot to say about that, but not right now. Today we're going to look at miniatures and terrain and some fun stuff I have coming up. So, blam, let's start with this. Tomorrow is D&D &D night. And I did try and set up XSplit streaming, just like we do for our mini wargaming live shows. But uh, we did have some technical difficulties with that. So I'm just going to record it and upload it like a normal thing, probably two to four hours of that. Why not? And so this is one of several scenario boards that I've worked up and am working up. We've got Janine here. And first off, very festive. Take a flourish, miss. There we go. Fantastic. <laughs> All right. She left her modeling career to, uh, to work here. So anyway, this is, as you know, the prototype for Ultimate D&D, which is if I made 30 of these, that would link together into sort of an adventure. And believe it or not, I could actually set these up all around the studio and either cover them or have them as presets, you know, where they could be created very quickly and actually do an adventure with all miniatures, all terrain, and have people out for a week. And the reason I think this is going to work is that for Valhalla, and by the way, we are not doing Valhalla in spring. We've normally had one in May. That's not a thing. And instead, I'm doing this, and there's five slots for it. That's it. You'll stay local. You'll be part of what we're doing. It's a gorgeous operation here. And boy, you will have a blast. And um, yeah, you will have a blast and be a better hobbyist and maybe even a better person for it. So anyway, so this is a uh, dwarven mining camp. So hopefully my players aren't going to watch this. So spoilers, spoilers alert. So anyway, yeah, just when I started putting on the little details, you know, they've got like a little fortified area here. I don't know, maybe it's a human mining camp. Still working out some of the details. So uh, anyway, got some uh, dead wood here. Uh, you know, this larger fallen log. You put in some deciduous trees here and, uh, and you've, really, you've really got something. I mean, I think it looks incredibly handsome. And, um, and, so, and here's that dark elf army. It's not quite ready for me to go through everything uh, with you on it. Um, however, it does, it has had all the repairs and touch-ups done to it. And let me tell you, there is a lot to this thing. In fact, let's just look at the, uh, the witch elf heroes. There's a lot of them. They're from different, they're from different lines. And there's a lot, oh man, just so much cool stuff in here. This is magnet, so that guy switches his torso down there. And we got this gals, these gals here. Cauldron of Blood. Oh, this thing just makes me happy. Just, just looking at it. I mean, geez. I hope I have this so I can run some of the guys here is in the D&D game. That's real, that's real exciting. So, and by the way, this is almost 200 models in this. It may very well be actually 200. It's at least 180. So, yeah. And by the way, that is on the block. You can, you can have this. You can have this delivered, like, in two to five days. You have to just be in your hands. Done. And so, anyway. All right. Let's continue. All right, so uh, that's one thing. D&D is tomorrow. I'm going to do just a regular recording of it and upload that, probably two to four hours worth. And, um, <clears throat> okay, uh, I have uh, both Thomas and Rich kind of um, uh, tentatively coming down for a bat rep. I'm trying to get them down sooner rather than later. I want to do a scenario, and this is the board that I made up for that. And again, just so many different combinations you can do with the uh, BTP Studio terrain. And, and th this stuff is like, we have a lot of terrain here. I mean, outside of like Warhammer World, uh, this is like the best collection I've ever seen. So anyway, um, yeah, so a little spaceport here and I put on little details like this, uh, you know, this tower, whatever these things are, one and two, put up these little control panels on them, a little bit of OSL on there, I think it's, it's kind of cool. 
And uh, these the people always ask me where these are from. These are from a game called AT43. This one's actually upside down. And they're very hard to find now. We have like eight of them, and it makes me happy. So we're going to do uh, Dark Eldar versus Imperials. This is an army that's for sale. And uh, boy, you can, just, you can just pick this up. It's uh, right around, I don't remember, it's like 1,200 or 1,500 points. And uh, it's a good starter army. It definitely needs some fleshing out, but it's got a good base. The four Venoms, two Ravagers, 20 uh, Dark Eldar Warriors. Um, some of them have like cool helmets and stuff, like from, uh, is it the Incubi? I, I, I don't know. So anyway, um, and then the Imperials over here, again, these, these are for sale. And it's about 950 points of Dark Angels. And this is a lot 4700 on the web store. This, I mean, this is already, it's been up there for like a long time. And so you've got 20 troops. These are good looking guys, man. Good looking color scheme. 20 troops, nine bikes, chapter master, uh, attack bike with multi melta, land speeder typhoon, a rhino, and then one extra oddball guy for some odd reason. I don't know, just to switch things up, I guess. And um, as a separate item, you have these Elysians. I'm running them as Militarum Tempestus, so Skyons, units of five, 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 so 30, and then nine extras. And uh, what's the list on that? There's a Vox, two grenade launcher, excuse me, three grenade launchers, three plas, six Meltas, six Flamers, uh, and then 20 Lasgun slash Sergeants in there, so. Uh, it makes, it, it doesn't quite all add up, even if you use them as veterans, but uh, you do have like alternates. So, and that, that's basically what's happening is that um, you can have alternate arrangements. So anyway, Dark Eldar book. So this is gonna be exciting. I'm probably gonna do the scenario where you can actually, like the Imperials are trying to like put demo charges on things and, and blow them up. Uh, oh yeah. Fantastic, look at that board. Cannot wait to hit that board. So, um, yeah, 950 for the Dark Angels and the Militarum Tempestus come out to, it's like 400 or 500, so uh, I, think, I think we'll be good with that. We may have to draw on uh, Dave's, uh, what's his, oh, and by the way, Dave was in yesterday, gonna say, and he really, I mean, he had well over a hundred listings ready to go up. So those will be going up soon. So keep your, keep your eyes peeled on bluetablestore.com. And let me tell you, now's a great time to trade stuff in. Um, I, w I definitely am interested in picking up new, uh, new lots. And you know what's great about the BTP store is that uh, it's, it's no pain. It's completely painless. We never like, you know, because like if you sell things on the secondary market, people are like, I got my things there, everything looks good, but one guy's missing his hand. Do you have the hand? Ah, oh, now at minimum, you've got to answer the hand question. So, when, but when you work with us, we just absorb everything. And there are no problems. We just sell, we just sell them so inexpensively. You put in a little TLC and you got something that's such a great deal. It's just fantastic. I'm loving the web store more and more as time goes on. And uh, I love new trades coming in. It's like, oh, it's like Christmas. And um, okay, there's more. So that Dark Elf Army's getting taken for a spin tomorrow, boom. So New Year's Day is gonna be bat reps and bat reps and D&D &D for me. So this is the table I conjured up for this. Pretty straightforward. Uh, we're gonna play it that all this lava doesn't affect anything. You just kind of scooch right over. This is just like an, an easy hill. I know that's not realistic, quote unquote, but you know, uh, it, it'll, make, it'll make for some good gameplay. Or maybe I'll just get rid of this entirely and you know, and work up to it. Oh, also, this Necron terrain set is still on the block. Um, it's not really Necrons, it's, it's whatever it is, but it's certainly suitable for that. And uh, this, is, this is a, look at how dense this is. I mean, you could practically play Infinity on this thing. It's great. 
So I've got, I've got that up. Check the liner notes for a price, or if you don't see one, just contact me. Uh, but boy, there is there's a lot to it. I just put some models on here for scale. They're not they're not included in that. These are old uh, alchemists from uh, Rackham Confrontation. Great base figs for conversions. You know, for a while there, they were really cheap. They were like up to like 80% off. You know, I think Miniature Market has uh, miniaturemarket.com has some on it. Also, try warpforgedgames.com. We've been working uh, with the owner of that and he has been really super to work with. He's accommodating, he's communicative. Um, he actually uh, reminds me of an early Neil from the War Store. Because uh, uh, we've been around almost as long as them, I think. So, um, guys, there's a lot going on at BTP. The artists are coming back uh, in force in like two to five days. And we're going to really get going on those projects. Our turnaround time has been steadily improving over the last eight months. Uh, that makes me happy. And, um, yeah, thanks for tuning in. We are here every, almost every day. And um, uh, we, are, we are ready to show you some new and fun things. Uh, in 2015. Happy New Year. Blue Table fans! <laughs> Demon fire of Warhammer Fantasy Bat Rep. Uh, we've got John here. John's gonna keep it real today. Gonna try. As the kids say today. Yeah. Yeah. In that newfangled lingo. <laughs> That's right. That they that they use. So it's High Elves v Dark Elves grudge match. Yeah. And oh yeah. It's on now. So uh, the Dark Elves naturally are the aggressors here, uh, invading the yeah. sylvan forests of Avalorn. I don't know if this is much of a forest. It's more like the plains <laughs> of... Uh, yeah, a clearing Yeah. with, for some reason, a Viking hut in the middle of it. Someone it could be, it could be a real thing. there, and yeah. that's, you know, you know, maybe that's an elf house. You don't, we don't know. Yeah, elves could elves about. could have houses like that. Yeah, that was a little racist. Yeah, you didn't, super racist. Didn't think God, that it could God. be that way. God. Yeah, they couldn't just have normal not, huts, bro. just like a normal person. Yeah. So anyway, uh, it's a pretty simple setup. We've got some um, terrain here. I don't know how that plays, but uh, basically um, rivers you can walk through them, but you can't march through them. And if you're okay. like, in them when you're in combat, you can't be steadfast. Yeah, you can. It uh, is like disarray or whatever yeah. it is. Okay, uh, we usually play this as just like a giant brick sitting here. Yeah. And then same thing here. Yeah. Um, and then easy hills. Yeah. Right. This stuff. So it's it's pretty open. The thing about Warhammer Fantasy is the 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 units themselves form the terrain, and make things interesting. All right, let's take a look at the Sisters of Avalorn. It's using the High Elves book. So for core, you've got a 30-strong unit of Lothern Sea Guard. Obviously, these are converted from Wood Elves and High Elves. And uh, you have a 10-strong with full command of uh, Silver Helms. And then uh, for heroes, we have an Archmage, a, uh, oh my gosh, what is it called? A Handmaiden. Hand and a lore master of Hoeth with Book of Hoeth. And she actually, the model actually has like a little book. And um, then um, 10, 15 sisters, a sky cutter, quite a handsome model. And I actually didn't think this model was very useful in the game, but uh, playing against um, Paul really showed me otherwise. Yeah, he really managed to get a lot out of it. And then a uh, frost heart phoenix here. Then you have your phoenix. Oh, yes. That and the Phoenix Guard. The Did I not mention the Phoenix no. Guard? The 30 Phoenix Guard, the big, yeah. uh, the big block of, of Doom. And these are based on Sisters of Avalorn and the new um, the Wood Elf Rangers, Woodsmen. The Rangers. Yeah, Wildwood Rangers. What, yeah, they have the, the yeah, great weapons. Great. So, and and that's, two bolt throwers. that's what stands for Halberds. Yes, and uh, the two bolt throwers. And uh, by the way, the uh, bases here, which are really, really very extravagant, uh, those are from uh, Cyborg, last I knew, in case you're wondering. So, um, uh, John, why don't you take over the camera and show sure. us what you got. All right, so, uh, I don't know, I, I don't quite remember if Sean mentioned it, but this is a 2,500 point game. And uh, so for the Dark Elves, we've got 40 Witch Elves here in core. Uh, Dark Riders, five of them. Uh, we got five Brolocks, or War Doomfire Warlocks, as they're uh, called in the book, I guess, if you if you like book names. 
30 uh, executioners here in a horde formation. Then we've got a uh, Hydra, two bolt throwers, and then uh, for lords and heroes, this this is uh, Hellebron. It's uh, actually an Avatars of War figure, I'm pretty sure. But the only Hellebron, this is this is much uh, much larger army than I'm using. The Hellebron in this army is is attached to the cauldron, so I'm going to use her as Hellebron today. And then this is a Tolaris. Uh, conversion here that we're going to use as Tolaris. Then we got a level 4 Sorceress, Supreme Sorceress as it were. And then this guy is going to be a BSB Master. And then this is another Master who, uh, he may look like he's on a cold one, but today he's on a Dark Steed. And uh, that is 2,500 points of Dark Elves. So we're going to do some deployment and we'll be back. Oh, by the way. By I'm the way. correcting a rather egregious tactical mistake, which is I'm uh, dropping the five what's their faces here and a Phoenix Guard and getting a BSB. Ah, uh, okay. So a BSB is in. Yeah, probably BSB good. Is necessary. Probably good yeah. to have the BSB. All right, we'll be back. All right, well, I'm going to roll out a little lower metal because fun. Okay, I want to get that on tape. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm doing it on tape right now. Oh, are you actually recording right now? Yeah, I am. Are you recording me say, please record me? Yes, I am. Okay. You're recording me saying that a second time? Please. Yes, it's like infinite loops. Yep. All right, so here we go. So we've got one, two, two, and three. So, Plague of Rust, Enchanted Blades, Glittering Robe, and a double. So, I think we're going to figure out what I want to do with that and then be right back. All right, so in the end, I decided to trade uh, Plague of Rust that I rolled for Searing Doom, the signature spell, and then my double I turned into Final Transmutation because I'm a jerk and that's what I want to do. And then the other two that I got were Enchanted Blade and Glittering Robe, which I like. So you, did you go over what they actually do? No, I didn't, but Would I will. Would you mind doing that with me right now? Oh, so yeah, sure, sure. Notes? So, so I, I want what it's cast on and then yep. kind of what it does. So Searing Doom is uh, a 10 plus, and it's a uh, magic missile, 24 inch range, D6 hits. And uh, for lore of metal, you always just roll on whatever their armor save yeah, the is. Armors, yeah, yeah, and that's how you wound them. Uh, Enchanted Blades is uh, a augment plus one to hit for shooting close combat attacks. For a target unit. I'm sorry, plus one to hit? Yeah, plus one to hit, and it also gives them armor piercing and uh, they become magical attacks. Okay, great. Okay, and then uh, Glittering Robe gives a target unit scaly skin five up. Okay, yeah, just one that's, model or the unit? Oh uh, no, it's a, it's a unit or I can instead have it be a bubble for so a plus, larger cast. Oh, okay, so plus one to armor save? No, five up scaly skin. Oh, so five then, up scaly. Oh, so Basically, you go five of scaly skin, and then you can, oh, add, no, then you can I, add your heavy armor it. and all that's that for fantastic. it. That's yeah. fantastic. So that, that casts on that a nine. Turns in heavy, that turns heavy armor into a three. Yeah, armor. yeah. That casts on a nine. Right. What uh, was blades again? What was the blades? Enchanted Blades casts on a nine as well. Okay. And then the last one I got is Final Transmutation, which is uh, an 18-inch direct damage spell, casts on a 15, and I roll a d6 for every model in the unit, and on a five up, it turns to gold, no saves of any kind allowed. Oh, wow. Okay. Well, yeah. I don't like that. Yeah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't like, like that either. Because that kills like a third of a unit. Yeah. And the Phoenix Guard. Yeah. I think is a looking at the targets for it's that. It's prime like target. The Phoenix Guard need to Oh, be definitely a prime target. A target. Uh, which elves will do well with scaly skin? Or yeah. I mean, any unit really would. Executioners are what I I would probably target yeah. them. Make them so tough. Yeah. Um, yeah. That's. That's a pretty good. That's a pretty good lineup of yeah. offense and defense. Yeah. I like it. There. All right. Well, let's do high elves magic. Okay. Um, I have two wizards. Uh, one of them is the uh, Lore Master of Hoeth, this model Yeah, here. so she just gets the signature of every spell, yeah, right? Yeah, she just gets a signature. Yeah. Now, I'm still using Army Builder. Apparently there's a better program out there now, I think. Um, Battlescribe or something? Battlescribe is good, like, because you can get stuff for free if people make the files. Uh, but I don't know that it's better than Army Builder. Oh, okay, fine. Yeah. There you go. Army Builder is certainly well used and well maintained. Yes. That's kind of like, yes. it's updated. Yeah, really like, if, well. if, if you can't find a good uh, data file for Battlescribe, then it's basically useless for your army, so. Yeah, uh, yeah. I had to, uh, I actually used a pirated copy of that for like 10 Of what, years. Battlescribe? 
No. Um, oh, of uh, Army, Army Builder? Builder. And then you finally so, bought it? Oh, but I've more than made up for it yeah, since yeah, yeah. then. <laughs> uh, since I started BTP, I probably bought like 12 copies of it. All right. So what's the, what's the level four well, rolling on? This is weird. I thought I printed out the... Um, I the spells? I printed out the spells, but... Well, I, I mean, I got the book open right here. Do you? Well, no, I, I'm doing high, high magic. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, you have the book open. You have the yeah. book right over there. <laughs> here we go. High magic. I'm gonna find it. Well, and the thing is, I texted Paul. He's still on... Yeah, Paul's uh, like basically the resident uh, Thomas of fantasy, essentially. Yeah, he he's, knows what he's he, doing. He plays the tournament. You'd think he... that would be me after all these years. <laughs> okay, here we go. Oh, Ooh, look at that. Doubles. Triples. So you're going so to get, get like whatever you two, want, basically. And then I get two and yeah. five. So the uh, number two spell is uh, Hand of Glo Well, you get Drain Magic and Soul Quench, right? Uh, well, those are your signatures that you can switch for. So you can swap for two different signatures. Oh, don't you just get them now? I don't think so. No? Yeah, Hand of Glory. Okay, and that's cast on a five. And it's an augment. And uh, Give some bonuses. one one uh, that I pick, weapon skill, bliss skill, initiative, or movement is increased by D three. That's actually uh, that's actually pretty fantastic. Yeah, definitely has some and, some ability. Uh, the more powerful one increases all four. Yep. And you just roll one D three for the whole thing, and that's mm. on a ten. Yeah, it's so that's pretty actually cheap. not bad. Yeah, pretty you should, cheap. You should just do that instead, because if you think about it, if you're going to throw at least two dice at it. Your your level four well, is going to be plus four. Unless you have one die left, and it's like, well, here's a low that level is hand of glory. That is dice. Yep. Yes, but a spell always fails on a one or a two. Right. So you don't want to throw one dice unless if you don't granted, have to. It's the last dice yes. that you have at oddball thing. Okay, and that's eighteen inches range. Okay, and then I'm getting uh, arcane unforging, uh, and it targets a single thing, suffers a wound, no armor saves. And then you reveal, and then on a two-up, one randomly selected one is drained and is no longer useful. That's kind of cool. No. It's, on, it's on a 13. And so I, I don't know how awesome that is. Okay, so for my two picks, I'm definitely taking Walk Between Worlds. And that's on an 8+. Plus and, give, and you know how I know that's good? Because Paul... Posed me with it by moving. He also around. he also used it a little incorrectly. Oh yeah, you our only, last game, as you may yeah. recall, I thought it made them ethereal for the turn. Just for the magic phase while like, they're moving until his next magic yeah. phase. No, it's just for that one magic, but it's still really good. Yeah, you still you get a lot of move movement. A, a unit yeah. like uh, in a critical way. Definitely during the magic phase, and um, I don't know. I'm tempted to go for giant fiery convocation, but <laughs> with two casters you want to have a lot of like smaller spells rather than one giant one. Um, so I'm just going to go with Apotheosis, which gives back uh, Lost Wounds. Okay. I just wrote Apotheosis. Good. Yeah. English, hard, difficult stuff. All right. So All there's right. magic. That, and so, we're, we're ready to go. So yeah, we're going to start doing deploying. Oh, yeah, yeah, first. yeah. Here we go. I rolled a six. And... A four. So I will choose to go first, or drop first. You got it. Okay. And we'll Folks, that was the teaser, and we will come back after deployment. Actually, we'll show you deployment, and uh, then we should have the rest of the bat rep up uh, later tonight or tomorrow morning. And by the way, Happy New Year. It's New Year's Day here, and uh, starting tomorrow, BTP should be back in almost full swing, and... Uh, yeah, looking forward to it. It's going to be a good game. We're back. Uh, we just deployed. Uh, John won the roll off and decided to deploy first. Because I had and... like one less drop, so just mm -hmm. like to get the plus one because I kind of want to go first. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> and uh, it really was close. So uh, let's take a look at high elf deployment. So hey. first off, you've got these. Hey, Tara, how's it going? Good. Mm -hmm. And uh, you've got these like sort of blocks in the middle and they're kind of right in the middle yeah. so but there is kind of this narrow way here mm -hmm. and uh, so high elves I've got the uh, frost phoenix here I ended up putting both bolt throwers on one side uh, quick note 
John has spread his bolt throws out, one there, one way off in the corner, and the corner deploy is not too bad. Yeah. As long like, as you're... I like splitting them up because as long as... Because if, if something fast gets to one of them, it's going to get the other one. Like, that's just how it goes. So by splitting them up, you have to, like, dedicate two things instead of just one thing, being able to just charge and cascade and... Yeah, it's it's good strategy, and at first I was going to do the same thing, but the problem was this giant building is here. Yeah, the building is. And the but or I could move it up, which makes it a little easier to access, like get to it. Uh, so that's not that great. But again, you know, it has it has kind of a limited uh, limited targets there because of this obstruction, and of course that one possibly late game. You know, so like late game, if the Dark Elves are all over here, that bolt throw is just sitting there doing absolutely nothing or skipping a turn to move. So, uh, but I did spread them out up here on the hill. And uh, so I've got my sisters. I put the, um, the uh, handmaiden here, the archmage, just as a, uh, a quote, bunker. And so this is, there's a lot of brutality coming out of this. And um, my Phoenix Guard and Lothran Sea Guard, and of course the Silver Helm. So it's going to be a really interesting game. How I see it playing out, because sometimes you'll have armies where one's kind of deployed here and the other is here. So you end up with that army kind of flanking on this direction and this army flanking on this direction. And you kind of have that because if you look at the uh, the heavy hitters, uh, you've got the uh, Frost Phoenix way over here, and you've got the Hydra way over there, kind of juxtaposed. And in fact, I'm looking at that Hydra, and I'm like. I have no idea how I'm going to deal with this at all. A bolt thrower. It's, you know, <laughs> there's, just, there's just really basically no possibility of me ever hurting it. And um, I, I'm just going to let it go and just rampage through the line. I accept. But yeah, bolt thrower would, would probably be your best option. Yeah. Well, there you go. What's the toughness in wounds? Uh, it has five wounds, and I think its toughness is five or six. Oh, okay. Well, that's, so that's actually not too bad. It's definitely dealable with, with yeah. bolt throwers. And by the way, I love in 7th, uh, excuse me, is it 7th edition? Yeah, it's tough what to edition find. is fantasy in 8th? 8th edition is, um, well, the way 40K is going, you know, you never know. Yeah, up. you never know what the edition is. evened right? up pretty soon. Yeah. They'll be like, oh, by the way, here's the new rule book. Is the rule new rule for 40K 9th edition fantasy? Mm, two years. it would be interesting. Okay, so... Uh, that's it, folks. Uh, tune in later for the full bat wreck. You want to give him the, the roll to see who goes first? On, oh, yeah, on let's, let's do it. Well, why don't you talk about your deployment a little bit? Okay, so I kind of just went off. Basically, yeah, I mean, I just uh, I started with the bolt throwers and put them down first. I was trying to get... Basically, he had a lot of drops that were, uh, you know, like the sky cutter and the phoenix wars, and he dropped his bolt throwers first, too. So I didn't get to see where his these things were going to be, so I figured I had to go in the middle with my right. main stuff and have this these are in pretty good position i threw these way out here for the start i don't know what they're gonna do but yeah i don't know i don't really know that much about my deployment i just kind of did things i was like a dog chasing nice cars. well and the thing is if the battle ends up over here this is going to prevent these two units from supporting each other well but on my side i got my them on the same is, thing i get the plus but, one to go first and i just kind of right. like try and go first and just get up there yeah, and I, I actually predict that's what's going to happen, that, that it's going to be a non-issue. And, you know, I'd like to think that the Silver Helms could take the Hydra, but uh, I know charge, that's not... They, if they get the charge, they realistic. have a pretty good shot. Do they? Because they have the lances, so they yeah. would uh, have the strength five attacks. Yeah, that's, but am I going to do five wounds? I, I, I don't think that's a real thing. Well, anyway, uh, but, you know, it could be a protracted combat. All right, folks, uh, thanks for tuning in, and we'll be back with the full bat rep later on. Oh, yeah, you're going to do the roll for whatever. Oh, yeah, yeah. So this will be, it'll well, take we, we three attempts. Off, yes, right? we do. Three attempts? Three attempts to actually summarize this oh, and yeah. get it done. Hey, I Four got it. I'm going Four and this. six. Wait, is this troll dice? Yeah, troll face. Oh, that's Those why you wanted dice. to use yeah, your own dice. dice. They're my dice. You mad, I bro? Bought, I bought them, so I want to use them. All right, fantastic. Okay. All right. Hey, Blue Table fans. It's time for the main portion of this Warhammer Fantasy Bat Rep. And, yup. <laughs> Here it comes. So, it's uh, top of the first Dark Elves turn one. Tell them all about it. So, uh, I did my vanguards and then moved my, all my fast cav. Got out of line of sight of that Phoenix, which I really like. These guys are going to do something. 
theory. <laughs> well, if I don't kill them, if you don't kill they'll them, be they'll, into the bolt throwers, and that'll be They'll either be into the that. bolt throwers or, uh, or go chaff something, one or the other. Right. He, after his, because he's just on a dark steed, I mentioned that in the intro. Right. It looks like a cold one, but it's a dark steed. Right. He, he vanguarded, and then he fast-calved uh, his way to out of line of sight of both of these units. So he his name is problems. Speedy the Cold One. Spe Speedy the Cold One. And he always one. wanted to be Speedy a dark not, elf steed. Speedy, not stupid, the cold one. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Alright, so then these guys just kind of pushed up, and this just pushed up. It, I, you would think a Hydra wouldn't, you know, care about water, but... Well, and you know what? Yeah, so I noticed that uh, John kind of kept these guys backed off because he didn't want to be charged by these guys. Yeah. But I actually think a better maneuver would be just to, like, get right up in my face. Well, I mean, like, at the go same ahead time, and I don't want to Because you'll lose. be steadfast, you'll slaughter them with your Strength 5 attacks, Mass Strength yeah. 5, and Horde... And this guy's coming up. Yeah, I don't want to. I don't want to. I want to keep everything kind of back here. Okay. Bit, just, I Sounds mean, good. I mean, you have some shooting. I have shooting. I don't think. I mean, maybe you think you outshoot me, so you don't have to come to me. But I don't know. I, well, I, think I, you, I, think I, I do will. outshoot you. You do? Well, Lothar and Seaguard, and these guys, <laughs> and the all the magic. I have magic. I have shooting. I have bolt throwers. I don't know. All right, I'm I'm I'm, I'm ready. Good. I'm ready. I, Let's, I mean, are you gonna keep the silver helms all the way back here, there? And yeah, let, just let that hold, come up to you hold just them. Because you yeah, can we'll shoot. see. All right, all right, magic phase. All right, here we go. So there's seven for me. All right, two channels, nothing. So what were the numbers again? Uh, five and a two, so you get five. Okay. And I have my one channel, which I don't get. Nothing. Okay. Nothing. So then one, the. Uh, the Doomfire Warlocks are going to try a Doom Bolt. Mm. Uh, cast By the way, that's why these are a must include for yeah, Dark Yeah, I really wish the army had more of them I would have taken. Way yeah. more than just a unit of five. Awesome. Is that same all this dark, has is same five? Same Dark Riders. Yeah, there's only five Dark Riders. Too, okay, no five and five. Well, yeah. well, if you pick up this arm, and by the way, the Dark Elves are for sale. The Sisters of Avalorn can be duplicated if you like them. Uh, I actually think they'd be quite handsome in green. I think green and white would be a great, right? Yeah. Be I a like great the color scheme. Idea. And by the way, the Sisters of Avalorn army, they double as wood elves. Yeah. So the army actually includes uh, two treemen. So this would be a commission. But the dark elves are for sale right now. And you can commission uh, more warlocks. I would commission more warlocks. Now, and now I, I see. more dark riders. Yeah. Now I see how these guys are so great. Turn one... Because if you do the math, it can be 12 inches up, you do a 12-inch vanguard, 18-inch yep. march, mm -hmm. you can literally be within 6 inches of your opponent's board edge. Yeah. You also, on turn one. If, if you had eagles or, or some, some fast cap of your own to kind of vanguard, mm -hmm. you can at least try and block my vanguard mm -hmm. if you get to vanguard before me. But right. Anyway. Well, because you could va I could vanguard out and then and at least make you take a leadership within, chest. Well, when you vanguard, if you can't vanguard to within 12 inches of an enemy. Oh, so okay. If you get to Vanguard first, then you stop my Vanguard. It's like a little mini game at yep. the beginning of the game. Okay. All right, I'm actually going oh, to change, change my mind here and go with a Did little I, Searing Doom. I gave him critical time to rethink Yeah, I'm going to go with Searing Doom from okay. her to the... Marathi's doing Searing uh, Doom? Well, just a, just a uh, Supreme Sorceress. Not okay. Marathi, but yeah. Oh, okay. I thought that was a special character. <laughs> no, just the just Supreme Sorceress. So uh, I'm just uh, on two dice. I need a 10 or better. She's a level 4, so... There we go. On an 11. Uh, 11. So I can either take it and like it, yeah. or try and do something about it. I'm going to throw two dice at it with a dispel. Okay. Here it comes. So I need, uh, you got an 11. I got so, uh, an 11. Yeah, I just need to get a 7 or higher. Here we go. Hey, three. Oh, that's and I brutal. blew up two you out of my never three dice. Do that. So uh, that's going to do d6 hits on them. Okay. One, one, one. one but their, their armor save is what, two up? Uh, yes. So it's going to wound them or on a three. two. So there's a wound with no armor save allowed. Okay. So, so there's uh, a silver helm. Yeah. Whoa, those magnetic movement trays are awesome. Yep, all right. So then next thing we're going to do is give... Well, well we're going to have her try... Hmm, maybe not. Let's see. We can, we can measure our ranges here. So if she wanted to do... Uh, there is no way to make that bigger. Oh, actually, yeah, I can. 18 plus. Mm, to make it a 36-inch wow. range. Five-inch dice. Five, yeah. Excuse me, five dice left. 
And I only have three to dispel, so... I think I'm, I'm going to go with, uh, with five dice on the big version of Final Transmutation onto your Phoenix Guard. Oh, what? <laughs> oh, this is bad. So, okay. I don't know no. if I even got it. Six, uh... You need ten, 18? Uh, yeah, well, 14, effectively. And so, so, you did. I did, I just got it. Oh, brutal! <laughs> so now, if I throw three dice at that... Because you got an 18, right? Yeah, you need like double sixes. Uh, yeah, double sixes I need like a lot. That's all my dice. So I'm going to well. blow up my dispel scroll. Oh, you're going to scroll. Okay. Yeah. That, that's probably I'm gonna a I'm going to have to because yeah. that's mathematically that's a third of the Phoenix Guard. Yeah. <laughs> Never mind putting a few wounds on the characters. Right. That is crazy. Oh, that is so scary. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, like their fingers start changing into gold. Yeah. And they're the, like, no, no, the, no, no. The, Do the not Archmage run. realizes it and dispels it. Awesome. They have three don't they? Loving it. Uh, well, they don't get any saves against it. Oh. Okay, ranged. That's, it's one of those bomb spells. Uh, yeah, ranged. We'll start with... Uh, bolt thrower number one. We'll shoot at... Bolt thrower! Bolt thrower! Bolt thrower, <laughs> bolt thrower numero uno is gonna shoot at... I think we're just gonna shoot the Phoenix. There's gonna be a lot of, uh, a lot of negative penalties for shooting partially through that. Oh, okay. Uh, is this going to be a solid bolt? What are you shooting at? The Phoenix. Oh, okay, I'm ready. Um, so is it minus one because I have cover? It's going to be minus two through something hard like that. That's a large target that makes it so they don't get... Mm, maybe. Oh. You're right. Yeah. Okay, so we did... Because we can do it like... Just for, so, for anyway. whether that's hard cover or not. The, well, I, I'm I'm saying that it's going to be hard. I, I don't know. I'm fine with it. What we found out <laughs> by looking but by, by looking up the rules is yeah. we found out that large creatures cannot gain like benefit like, like, from obst steps. what was it obstacles, obstacles. Yes. which is long fences and like hedges and stuff. Hedges. But cover is something different than that. So technically, the phoenix does get the minus two. Yeah. I think which let's just call it minus one. Well, I'm just going to I'm just going to change my target then and oh, shoot okay. at them. With All right, my, awesome. With the, with Multiple the bolts. Yeah. Got it. Six so, uh, bolts. So long range, long range. no other modifiers. Looking for four ups. So four ups. And wouldn't it be funny if this were like a zillion times worse for me? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and now strength four versus toughness three. So yep. looking at uh, three to wound. Well, okay. Two. two. Fantastic. And, uh, strength four and... Uh, no saves. I think... I think, four armor I think it's just straight for armor piercing, so I, yep. I don't know what they're saying. That, or they only have light armor. They only have light armor, okay. Last I knew. And then given the, the length of this, I think this is just going to end up having to shoot the sky cutter. Yeah, they just have so light armor. So this one's going to end up shooting the sky cutter. Okay, I'm ready. Uh, long range, so looking for a four. Okay. And I don't get it. Just a two. All right. All right, uh, I need to check out some repeater hand bows and what those do. Cause, okay. All right, here we go. Repeater, crossbow. Because these guys it? didn't march. They didn't. They just went. But they're quick to march. fire, so I think they can march and shoot. Oh, fast that's cavalry. right, for fast cavalry. Uh, I just have to see exactly what they actually have. They have yeah, uh, repeater crossbows, which are not quick to fire, but they're those fast cast, so they can move and do it. So they fire two shots each. Two, four, six. Eight, ten. Uh, Searing Doom and, and then try the final transmutation. Uh, so they're going to shoot at uh, their armor piercing. I think they're just going to also shoot at your bunker here because I'm gonna. It's going to be really hard for us to wound the the war machine. Yeah. Well, there's twelve. So if you get another wound on them, Are they, cross they have to make a test. Oh. And if these Second gals ran repeater. off, that would be like a crippling blow to the to the army. So um, they're they're close range, so no minus for that. But they move. Yeah, it doesn't mean because they're fast gal. I think that's only when they march. They moved. Um, we're looking for minus one, so it's gonna be fours here. Okay. Okay. So that was about half. And, Strength uh, three, toughness three. Yep. So there's two, and it's armor piercing, so minus one to your save. Oh, it is. Okay. Yep. Well, then they just die. Two of them. Okay. Yep. That's a lot less shooting coming out of that unit. That's yeah. That was that was really good. That was a very good maneuver for them. So. Okay, Tess. Yep. So here, on a nine. 
Makes good. it with a six, thank goodness. Okay. Now, does this hero have a bow? Nope. Okay. He's just, uh, he's just chilling over there. I think I get over there. He Vanguarded, he's and then he's, yeah, he's on the dark steed. Gotcha. So, he's on uh, Speedy the Cold One. Speedy the Cold One. Flying. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Basically. All right, we're on to High Elves' turn two, then. Oh, turn one. one. Okay, so my only... Oh, oh! Okay, I didn't see that coming, and I should have. The Phoenix is charging them. Okay. I'm so fleeing. here we go. So 12. Oh, oh my gosh. All right, and I go 10 inches so plus the best out of two. Wait, can you right stop through? just oh, for a second? Okay. Put them back where they were. Because if I, well, let's see if I get box cars. No, nope, doesn't matter. I won't catch them. Okay. okay. Well, I'm going to bounce through my own unit and stuff right now. So. All right, fantastic. So, so that just moves the Phoenix. Panic checks. Uh, I do believe, do they, if they run, uh, it moves uh, the I lowest, think. yeah, six I inches. Six so uh, panic here check go. here. Wait, aren't they frenzied? Yeah, they are. So I okay. guess they, they don't, they're immune to psychology. All right, we're on the mat. Oh, wait, I do have the rest of my move. All right, High Elves, ta uh, bottom of the first, High Elves first turn. Failed charge on the part of the Phoenix, leaves it just six inches in. However, bolt throwers all clear for landing the shoot at the Warlocks, but with a four-up save, they might actually last and end up doing something terrible. Now, I moved out my, yes. Carriers can't march, so they got to move it back. What? Cherry, cherry. Rolling for winds of magic? Three and a four. And channel? channel? None. No channel. Seven dice. Okay. Now if you want to make your plans. Yes. Oh, and we found out that chariots cannot march. The sky that. cutter is a yeah. chariot. And uh, I thought they had dropped that from last edition, but apparently not. All right, folks. The um, lore master of Hoeth here. She's going to cast, with three dice, she's going to cast uh, Mystifying Miasma, a hex, on this guy. Range is 48 inches. And I'm going to cast the higher cast version that, of it. Can you cast that in anywhere in your, in your line of sight? Or do you yeah, that's the definition of a hex, okay. right? All right. I'm just, I, okay. I don't know. All right. <laughs> um, here it goes. I need a 10. And she's got plus two. So that makes it with a 12. Okay. Do you want to re-roll any of the dice for the book? Oh, yes, that's right. Uh, no, no, because I got it, and if I re-roll it, I might not have it. Uh, that, that can go off. That's fine. Okay, great. So, uh, I should have the card here somewhere, so. It is minus, one, minus D3 to every one of weapon skill, ballista skill, initiative, and movement. There you go. Thank you very much. So minus two. two. Okay, and then uh, the next one, the um, Archmage, that's her. She's going to cast... Uh, Alario the Radiant. It does need line of sight, right? No, oh, does it? A hex needs line of well, sight? Well, it says N, no. Oh, I thought it said yes. N, no. no. Lie within forward arc, no. Need, oh, it oh, just needs line of sight. You, but you do need line of sight. Yeah. But it doesn't have to lie within your forward arc, so. It's, it, weird. It, yeah, it, that, that's a weird uh, way to put it. Weird thing, yeah. Oh, well, then, I, then, I, then I can't do that. Well, why not? It doesn't because have to lie within here. your front arc. She's in the unit. Oh, okay, fine. But, but that you should have line of sight. Let's roll. Well, no, she's, <laughs> we she's right like here, this. and all these guys are in the way. <laughs> so there's no way that's line of sight. Well, that, do you see what I'm saying? I think, I think just you can. It. Let's just keep and it. And we'll just keep going. Okay, let's keep if, going. If we're wrong, we're wrong. Okay, I'm hand of glorying them, which is an augment spell, 18-inch yep. range. Okay. And that needs, I'm doing the higher level of it, and that needs a 10-plus for all four characteristics. Uh, yes, with yep. a 10. With a 10? Awesome. And that's going to give... Plus what for all of them? D3? Plus D3, yeah. Like which ones? Initiative? Uh, movement, initiative, uh, weapon skill, and ballistic skill. Weapon skill is the only one that really matters. And how many dice do you have left? One. Just one. Okay. Yep. And so chances are it'll just be a Book of Hoeth thing. Yep. Mm. And you got it just on a 10? Yep, roll, just on a 10. I'll roll three dice at it. Okay. Yeah, you need to roll pretty low. And Seven I just is beat an eleven. By one. <laughs> okay, Shem's burning gaze, same thing. Okay, uh, that's from her, the archmage, and it just two. needs a five, d six, whatever hits on the okay. witch elves, and I get a three, and that's successful with a seven. I'll try my one, and that's a three, which matches. Okay, so because not much. Hellebron gives them the plus four. Fantastic. <laughs> Hellebron, wait, so Hellebron is in this. Hellebron's, Hellebron I, I is said right Marathi. here. Okay, yeah, Hellebron's right, right there. 
and I have no idea what she does. She's and bad. That's probably She's not brutal. good. <laughs> Is she? She has like ten attacks, and or, yeah. well, okay, sorry, seven plus D three, and uh, yeah. Wow. Boom. Yeah. She's 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 stupid. She's okay, stupid. fantastic. So Speaking That's of stupid, why I took her, yeah. <laughs> two, four, six. Okay, six shots here, okay. close range, didn't move. Three. Uh, one miss. That's fantastic. Strength four versus toughness three means I need a three up to wound. Oh, three. Only three wounding hits. They have four up uh, in four up in or ward, ward rather, and I made all three. Oh. Okay. Next bolt thrower. Wait, wait. Well, well, this you, one you wouldn't have it. You can see over the it. bolt thrower because of the hill. Yeah. But Let's the phoenix should, I guess. Well, well the, the phoenix is, isn't really blocking this guy true, right here. I don't know. Right. That, that might be a 40k thing. I don't really care. It doesn't matter. <laughs> no, even true line of sight. It doesn't matter. Has them pretty it open. It doesn't matter to me. <laughs> okay, all but one. one. Looking three. for threes. Three. Hey, there's oh, three. nice. Well, uh, cocked. Yeah. Five. Five. Right. It was meant to be. I made only two, so three of them are going to die. Fantastic. There. Good. So make your test. Oh, wait. That, is that at the end, or as we go along? If, if, if you're not going to shoot anything else, Adam, I can, I can go ahead and make it. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to. Okay. And uh, their leadership is All right. something. Eight. Let me at least prep this. Eight. Okay. Eight. They're good. All right. Fantastic. Well, they could still do a lot of damage to the bolt throwers. Kill this one and be into that one next turn. Yeah. All right, so uh, here the uh, Sisters of Avalorn shooting at the Witch Elf. May as we get started on those. Um, they are uh, five, ballistic right? skill five. Yes, that's They're right. Range, what, Minus one for long yeah, range. Yeah, long range. Yep. So uh, strength is four, which is so why great. they're awesome. Oh, okay, only two. Sure. Uh, yeah, I think I just lose them because I don't think I have anything against that. Okay, she's got the Reaver bow. That's three shots hitting on two ups. Strength is plus one, so strength four. Okay. So that's the handmaiden versus them. Yep. That's a magic item combo I picked up from Paul. Again, three more. Okay, Sea Guard at them. They have uh, extra ranks. So I, uh, with volley fire, I think gives them 20 shots. Uh, plus they half get, of what's left. Is that right? No, first front three because of oh. high elves, and oh. then half of the remaining. Okay, yes, you're right. I'm sorry. I was thinking horde formation. So it's... So you have 5, 10, 15, 15 plus, plus eight. half of 15, so 8, okay. so 23. One less. Okay, three. front rank at close range, threes. Ooh. Okay, that's hits. Yep. And then the rest need fours. Fours and fours. Da, 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 so, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Which is they didn't have lighter. All right, and uh, yeah. I, no, they got nothing. Yeah. Okay, uh, I, they have frenzy, so they don't take break yeah. tests. Uh, but I think I would, I peel off like oh, eight yeah, witches off, there. You pulled off 10 and 11, 10 and 11, 12? Yeah, yeah. That's every, good. every little bit counts. That's good. Unfortunately, the warlocks are still around. And, are you going to shoot with the crew there? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Okay, oh, three. Okay. Three. I'm going to do that, that against the hydra. the hydra. Why not? Okay, close range. Here it comes. Uh, Move close. Uh, fours, sixes, no. nothing. All right. Okay, and uh, I pass to you. All right. So. Uh, All right. Here we go. What's happening for charges? Uh, well, these two units, since they're frenzied, they either need to. If I don't declare a charge, they have to take a test to not charge. Okay. So, right. um, I'm just kind of measuring what I got here. Which, so, there, 14 there, so that'd be a 9 for them, hmm. or, whoops, sorry there, Lord Master, Queen Oh, she doesn't fit on. Yeah, her. she's, so that'd be an 11, so that'd be 7 there. I think, uh, I'm gonna have both of these units attempt to charge there. Oh, both at the Phoenix Guard, yikes! Actually, yeah, I'm ready. Actually, I think I'm going to have to just have them charge the Phoenix Guard. Okay. Only because if I do both, the, these guys are going to fit. Well, then, you'll, you'll be very diluted. Yeah, well, they're, they, can't even, they can't stuck. even fit right here, is, is okay. my 
um, I could I could like do my one wheel to go like this and hitch in and then go like this and then block them. Right. Was the other thing. So. Well, a little a little unwieldy. Yeah. Um, so I think I'm just going to do witches. Hope the sheer number of attacks and right. and uh, poisoned attacks is just enough to to force All the right. casualties there. Now they and don't normally have poisons, do they? Yes, they do. Do they really? Uh -huh. Fantastic. That's great. They don't normally have uber frenzy, but Hellebron's there. That's a 15, more like a 16, basically. Yeah, 15, no, corner 15. to corner. So that would that be a 10 for them. Yep. Yeah. Well, they'll... You may as well, if they're just going to hold yeah. back, you may as well just kind of trundle and, forward They're going to try bit. and charge them. Okay. And they're going to charge the Phoenix Guard. All right, I, I'm so ready. We'll Let's do it. start with them there. Okay. So Looking for a 9? What uh, is it that you it need? Was, it was an 11, was I think. 14. No. Yeah, 11-inch charge. So they need that's a, to them. Yeah, eleven inch charge there with so a five, six. so six. Okay, here it comes. A one and a that's one. That's ones. That's nothing. Oh, that is the worst. That's one inch forward. Okay, and then that and then gives me another turn to get my there. bucks on. Here we go. <laughs> Two and a one. Oh, where are you, troll faces? Can't do it. Can't when do I need it. you. Just, just can't do it. All right. Well, that's well that, was, that was that was pretty that's sad. Fine. That's fine. You know, you really should have hail married that Hydra into the. I probably should have. Yeah. I, I don't mind if you want to give it a shot. All right. Yeah. Because it's a, six inch move, right? Yeah, I need a nine there. I'm going to hail mary the Hydra. And get it. Get yeah. it with a nine. Oh, well, where are you going to fly? Why did I have where to? Where are you going to keep it? Oh, I, I would oh, have helped. Oh, and of course he's going to charge the rear of them. Oh, okay, there. great. Let's do it. So I'm minus now, two to Now, minus movement. two movement. Okay. Well, but you so still auto nine, get it. Yeah. I don't know he's why in, that... He's in even with a three. Okay, minus yeah. Minus two movement, he's a seven. You're right. So You're right. Okay. he goes into the rear of them. And now yeah. I'm about to find out what sort of hideous combo this guy has. Well, it's really not that bad, actually. Especially with the negatives, it should be. Oh. So he's going in here. Wow, oh, what? And, uh, oh, Silverhelm's, why did just you gonna expose go like this, yourself? So that you, no, please gonna... don't. Just, no? just make them make it not butt it okay. up like that. There you go. Okay, that's we'll, fine. A little cinematic there. All right, that's fine. Fine by me. All right, uh, then magic time it is. Or, well, rally here, actually. Mm -hmm. Which they rally. They love it and can act normally. They can shoot, like, shoot normally. Well, yeah, you really don't have a whole lot of movement. Oh, you want to charge here, too, right? Um... Maybe not. Their, their match might be better than their, really? than their okay. most combat ability. I'm going to check, though, because I don't know that much about them. All right. Dark Elves have moved. Yes. So after uh, all the... Oh, I should charge that guy. Oh, I should charge that guy. It's not letting me do it all. We've got the Warlocks in over there. This guy right. in the back there. Yeah, because you forgot. Forgot. Yeah, yeah. Didn't do it. Dumb. Dumb. Yeah, there you but, go. But I'd, I'd rather have a good game. Yeah, so the Hail Mary you know. with the Hydra works. These guys, yeah. they, they rallied and then they well, did their little And the thing is, on the no, net, no, though, no. because of these two failed charges, I'm still doing okay. The problem is, if I don't deal with this guy, this whole Phoenix Guard unit is just like, they need to be more like you know, stuck. They, they, need to you be know. they need to be. They need to be able to block you. Okay. Oh, and so as it turns guy. out, it turns out something I need to pay attention to is I get plus one to my high magic rolls. That could matter. It didn't matter before because the one that was a tie was for the lore master and that wasn't high magic. The other thing is high elves auto pass fear, terror, and panic checks when playing Again, dark elves, dark elves, which is not as good as uh, what the dark elves get. Oh, I get it's hatred against you and yeah. Yep. So, so anyway. Yeah, so when you took a panic test, then you didn't have to and stuff like that. That is true. That well, is true. Okay. So, so, live uh, and learn. Yeah, we're on a magic. Thing. We might even get another game in with these, like a grudge match. Yeah. Because I, I feel a grudge coming on right. here. <laughs> okay, let's do it. All right. Uh, Roll your magic dice. The magic. Jeez, you take so long. Five, three, and two. Okay, I get three. No channels. Ooh. Mathematically, I, I should have a well channel by now. All right. So with my five dice, what do I need? What do I need to do? What do I need to get done here? I, you should do the transmutation. Throw five dice at transmutation. Probably. That's it, because I only have three dice. If I may, I only have three dice to counter it. Yeah. You only need a 14. Mathematically, you're solid on five. Five dice is 17 or 18, plus your whatever. Oh, you do need an 18. Well, yeah, I could, so I, you're well, that's a very high percentage well, to do, do it. The, that's, now that I'm closer, I can do the... And where do you do need help? Range. You don't need help anywhere. I can do the shorter range one now. I don't have to, you know? I don't have to go for an 18. I can just do a 15. Every, yeah, great. So I could do that. The other thing I could do is is because uh, I don't have another dispel scroll. Yeah, I guess wings, I guess I might right? as well just try and final trans be a jerk. You know, a little bit. Four. So I need a fourteen on these five dice. Yep, here it comes. 
for the small version of... It should be automatic. Yeah. And well, there's the miscast, oh, so... there it is. Okay. So, I so can't it's going to go off here. Else. So there's 30 dudes in that unit? Yep, that's right. Well, right. it's 28 and two characters. 28, so 30. So that, that's the yeah. difference. Five. I don't know if the characters, you know, you roll uh, them separately. I don't believe so. It just says, uh, roll a d6 for every model in the target unit on a 5 bucks been turned to gold and removed as a casualty. Okay, yeah. That's uh, a fine, like, would I have to do a lookout, sir, or something like that? And Nobody knows. Oh, and uh, we'll, we'll do this here because any any unit around them at, at the start of your next turn or when your move has to take stupidity tests. Oh, really? Okay. If, I think it's if any cap called. Oh, because time. it's so horrible to see them no, turn No, 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 it's more, it's more that, ooh, gold. <laughs> oh, I see. <laughs> it's shiny. Yeah. Hey, and that's, that's a lot of gold. Like, oh, if they're yeah. a mason-sized statue yeah, made of gold. Goes. Hold on, let's do the value on that, because obviously it's, <laughs> it's denser than the you. The beard adds at least 200 So let's see, let's say it's pound uh, gold 600 is pounds $22 is $20,000. $20,000, so that's a lot of So gold. it would be 600 pounds. Now it's a gold, like a thousand bucks now, isn't it? Uh, yeah, about 1,200. Yeah. Yeah. I that's love down. Gold. Gold. Oh. Here we go. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to fives and sixes. Yeah, here it comes. Whoa! A nice vein of sixes right here. Nice. T by the way, if it gets more than ten, that will be above average, and we're already looking at seven. There's eight, ten. Nine. Eleven. Ten. Twelve. Eleven. Twelve. Twelve. Wow. wow. Okay, I'm going to take this opportunity to pitch BTP movement trays and tell yeah. you how awesome they are. <laughs> this okay, is so awesome. for a unit of three, first off, you'd need thirty little metal plates to put yeah. on the bottoms of the guys, but then you get the 10 trays, so you just move this off, so this goes back. It's this unit. Oh, oh you're doing mm -hmm. on Loth and Seaguard? I can't target them because they're in combat. Yeah. Oh, awesome. Oh, great. I don't care about these guys. <laughs> Stupid elves. Okay, and then, so now this just goes back into your, uh, you know, your carrying case or whatever, and uh, is too. ready to, yeah, abs ready to go for next time. So it's, uh, it's very easy. And uh, so we don't typically sell like ones that hold like 20 guys. We do it in 10s. 10s, 12s, or 14s uh, is the is the one. The 20 guy do. ones are good for goblins because they die so much. Yeah, they die, they die <laughs> so quick. But really, you can move a horde around. Like, look, look at these guys. These are all on just 10s. Yeah. 10s and 5s. So... And they, they slide around real easy. You, you actually can't even tell the difference. And it actually does help when they're like partly on a hill or something like that to not have them. So anyway, cool all right, well, I'd have to take a panic check, but don't. I don't. Here's my miscast. Oh, yeah. Did you got the chart? Seven, up? yep. So that That's... is detonation. Uh, all models in base contact with the wizard suffer a strength 10 hit. So it's uh, oh, one, yes. two, three. Three executioners. That's strength disappointing. 10 hit. And two of them don't that. even, so one guy just goes splat. <laughs> totally worth it! <laughs> uh, did it say including the wizard? I don't know. Maybe I read that new Hold on. This is, this is what I look like right now. <laughs> um, not the wizard himself. Wow. wow. I can't. I can't. And it's the most, That's it's insane! Most, it's the most common. Yeah. It it's really seven. stinks for ogres. Well, actually, not really. It's only ten, which is one yeah, yeah, you're right. It'll kill one ogre. It'll kill an ogre. Yeah. yeah. No, yeah, no instant well. death in fantasy. Yeah, well. Everybody well. has eternal Killing warrior. Blow. Oh, yeah. All right. Oh, yeah. God. That is, by the way, that is the hallmark of a nerd, to automatically say the exception to the rule. Yeah. To be technically <laughs> correct. Killing blood is working with monsters. Yeah. No. I, think, uh, I think we all do. You need to roll killing blood for that. Okay, so what's next? Why shooting. Are we shooting. Yeah. Yeah, I'm we got, ready. Uh, I'm, not, I'm not even worried about your shooting. All right. Well, we'll do our... And bows there. Three, eight, eleven, twelve, and they will shoot at them. Uh, so I marched. It makes me realize blade riders are really awesome. So I oh, think I just need I think I just need four then because I just I marched and that was it. Yeah, if there were, if I may, oh, if there were a shot. fast cab that could hit hard too, and I think that's your wild riders, man. Because they're fast yeah, cav, too. Yeah, because they're horses? Because those are straight forward armor person, right? Well, with their shooting, yeah. they hit hard. They yeah, but... Oh, are you talking about melee? Is that what you're talking Yeah, well, because oh, nobody, nobody thinks rider. to take, yeah. like, 20 fast cavalry in a unit. Like, an, in, like a big block of in, oh. infantry that just zooms around. 
But the Wild Riders is that. What are they, like 23 points apiece or yeah, something, something like that? Yeah, something like that. They're pretty expensive. That's, That's expensive. not yeah. bad, though, when you think about no, the hard-hittingness and the maneuverability. Anyway. The, cheap, uh, the cheapest good ones is actually the like, Spider Riders because their spiders are poison. Which yeah, is nice. there you go. Because, yeah, the mounts actually do stuff for you. So, uh, okay, hold on. You rolled a four and a five, right? It's only on your magic phase. Oh, this is the fire, the phoenix thing. Well, no, no, both of them get that, but you take it from your phase. Oh, I do? Yeah, but you rolled a, a four and a three. I'm yeah, sure. but it doesn't... It, it, it's both phoenixes, I promise you. That's okay. just no, phoenixes, no, no, no. Right? no, I see it, I see it. I was just seeing if he had something that would like freeze these guys uh, <laughs> or give them any advantage, but it is it it's base contact. It's just base contact. Base yeah. contact. Base contact or minus one strength. Yeah. Yeah. All right, we can and get no rid of this class, card yeah. now. No, no, that's oh. for the. They turn to gold, so the oh, stupidity yeah. test. Oh that's yes, for, okay. help us remember that. Uh, so here's their shooting. They moved and they're firing multiple shots. Okay. So uh, fives. Fives. Hit okay, that. I'm ready. Wow, that's pretty good. That was pretty good. That was, that was extremely good. Like half? <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh strength gosh, three, fours. Uh, four. Wow. That strength is three incredible. armor piercing. Yeah, they yeah. just die. Four dead. Holy crap. That, that is terrible. Do they have light armor? Or no? They have yeah, light it's armor, but it's just armor, light armor piercing. Oh, it's armor? Just, yeah, no, just light armor. Yeah. So she's in there now. That is not so great, guys. Uh, These throw? guys have... Definitely pulled their weight like this the game. That's crazy. Uh, bolt thrower is going to fire okay. the Phoenix now. Now he's up. Yeah, now that he's up there, I can see him right over there. Yeah, yeah. so I think my top one was a four, so yeah. that's plus one attack. Plus one attack. Oh, yeah, there's no cover now. No cover now. Well, I mean, I, don't know. I can see. Meet me halfway Phoenix. and give me minus one. Sure, we'll give you minus one. Okay, I'm ready. Um, one shot? Yeah, so should, You should still do multiple shots. If for no other reason that it's, it's tough, fun. It's tough to six. Is it six? Oh, yeah, you're right. That was five. Six. <laughs> the, oh, the frost heart is six? Yeah, you're yeah. right. Oh, the, yeah, the frost heart is better. Frost heart's Heck. way better. All right, way better. sounds good. You're not likely to wound it either way, so you might as well go for the D6, I would say. Well, it's... What a I, great fig, too. If I do the one, if I do the one shot, it's it's less likely to hit, but it's a four up to wound. And then there's the D, the D3 yeah, wound or whatever three, it is. It'll hurt a lot more. I don't know, maybe I should just shoot the six shots and keep going to them. Yeah, that's probably the, that's best, probably idea. the best idea. Try and peel some stuff out there. So, still yeah, there. just long range. So, uh, needing fours on them with the, the spread shot. There's three. And mm -hmm. uh, we have to, like, randomize it. I don't care. No, just for fun. Oh, yeah, whatever. Ah, what a hit. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> that's fine. Um... I have to, like, randomize. Wait, because... the bolt thrower is shooting here? Yeah, with the six shots. Oh, flip. Do yeah, you randomize? do randomize after, I think it's less than five guys. Okay. So, so let's just roll with that. Right? Well, I have three, so it would be, what, like, uh, D3 for each of them to see what it hits. One or the unit or the three. Just roll fives and sixes. That's the easiest way. Four will be the character. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, yeah. sure. Yeah. So, so wait, we'll go one, one, two, yeah. three, four. One, two, three, four. Right. right. Wow. Roll fives and sixes. So okay. two on two on the handmaid. Oh jeez. And so on the unit here, that's uh, a wound, and she's okay. just toughness three, right? Yep. Well, she still has. She's a lookout, sir, right? Uh, I think you have to have five models. Oh yeah. So she, I think she's gonna take a wound there. She okay. She's well, she's the handmaid of the Ever Queen. Right. Okay. Uh, solid shot. By the way, I really got raked over the coals right here. That was incredible. Yeah. What's the toughest on the chariot? It's, uh, I'm going to say five. Let's uh, take a look. Come on, Skycutter, where are you? Probably, Could probably be... five, at least. I would say. Could this be more be difficult? Something. It would be weird to have a chariot that was a four. Yeah. But the high elves do manage it. <laughs> Seriously? With, really? Yep, Seriously? toughness is four. Come four up on. safe. Can I see it? Yeah, sure thing. Right. Bottom entry. Strength five. Toughness. Four. Wow. That is... ah. Okay, well, in that case, we're going to spread shot that thing. Well, it has to be lighter because it's close. You're right, it's got to fly. Yeah. It's within close range, too. Yeah, it's close range now, so just threes. So there's four, and uh, so strength four average. versus four, so four is two at strength right. four armor piercing, so minus two to your save. Yep, which is sixes. Four. Yeah, probably a lot of sixes. Nothing takes, takes two, two wounds. wounds. You get a marker for that. Yeah. All right. Uh, then it's combat time. 
Yep, now stuff is going to happen. So I'm going to start with the Hydra, probably, which means your, your Silver Helms will go. Yep, that's uh, right. All right. Okay, High Elves always strikes first. Yep. Weapon skill is higher. Yeah. Here it comes. And Looking you get rerolls. Threes. Why do I get rerolls? Oh, uh, because always strikes, strikes first, first and higher initiative. And high. Initiative of five. So there Great. you go. Strength Eight three. out of nine hitting. Six to win. Six to win. Yep. So, nope, not nothing. a one. All right. Uh, okay, the Hydra's going to go. So it's got five wounds left. So it's got five attacks plus three. And it's going to do its uh, breath weapon, too. Yeah, I'm ready. So uh, we'll start with the breath weapon. Yeah, That'll be my fun. My good armor might help me here. 2d6 hits from the breath weapon. What's the strength of it? Four. OK. So eight. So eight hits. So it's two, five, eight. OK. Is that right? Yeah. And now this is three. So threes. Looking for threes. So all but two there. We did forget the four horse kicks. So we are uh, backing up for that. Fours. Uh, not always strike yeah. first. Sixes. Nothing. All right. So anyway, okay. those six so wounds. Six wounds. Two up becomes a three up. So yep. here it comes. So one, two, three. Okay. Then What's Hydra next? has his eight attacks because he has five wounds left and three base. So three plus call, right? the oh, yes. attacks I believe, or the what? The handlers. The handlers don't attack at all. It's just a combined. It's combined yeah. profile. Yeah. So I'm up to skill four. So I need fours to hit you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Fours and twos. Yep. And now twos. So okay. uh, and strength five. Yep, strength five for the Hydra. All right. Four. Oh. Yeah, minus two. It's yep, that's two. right. So. Fours. Uh, that's two dead, perfectly average. So five are gone. So uh, again, BTP yep. movement trace. So you did. So really... we did five. Plus a charge. No so six, and I have yeah. a banner. So well, I'm at minus you five. Stay no matter what. You stay no matter what because of your, Why? your the Valor of Ages thing. Or whatever it is. Yeah, Valor of Ages. No, no, no. no, no it, that's it's it's immune test, to right? panic. That's Not different than a break test. test. Oh, that's right. Huge difference there. Minus yeah. five. Oh, wow. Wow, I'm unbreakable. Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> All your, around. Have your BSB yeah, too. I got it. So okay. I'm minus five, so eight becomes a three. So I have two chances to get a three or higher. BSB is within 12 inches. Here comes one. And two. Ooh, close, close, but no cigar. Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go after you there. Uh, I don't have anything. Okay, Why sounds not? good. So, um, fling, 3d6. Uh, I'm getting a 10 versus a 9. A nine. So awesome. You're going to go 10 directly back there. Thank you. So you're going to end up there, and I'm going to go an inch behind you. <laughs> <laughs> that would actually be the hot looks. Yep. <laughs> Yikes. You realize if I lose, it's going to be harder on you guys in the D&D &D game tonight. Oh, okay. So I was fully planning on it, but like a little mini adventure. We owe it to our lives to at least do an encounter. Let's do something, you know, because we didn't go last week. You can't just let it just not go. But they'll be here on Got to roll. Thursday. Okay, so, uh, okay, what do you guys want to do? I don't care. I know Drew. Okay, Drew don't care. Me. You're not really into it, right? No, not this week. But there you go. Yeah. We'll just wait. All right, well, we'll see if somebody it's else It's more shows. fun when there's all four of us there. Is it? Okay, yeah. fine. Plus people Trust are me, you're going to enjoy having fun. Steve playing your game. Am I? You are. <laughs> all right. Okay. We, uh, we shall see. Right here. Okay, let's do it. So, I'm ready. Uh, we both have always strikes first. Yep. So... We go at the same time, but no one gets three rolls. Okay, sounds good. So I'm I ready. have. Uh, do you want me to go first? Yeah. All right. So I have three attacks. What? What? Okay. What am I ultimately? Weapon skill. Weapon skills four. No, no. Um, oh, you're so minus two minus in your two weapon, weapon skill. skill. So I'd be yeah. weapon skill four as well. So it's yeah. gonna be forced to hit on my uh, three attacks here. Yeah, and you and have I'm, always strikes first. Yes. But, uh, uh, but your so initiative you. is minus two. Doesn't matter. Right, but it does matter for. Oh yeah, that's right. Both always strikes first, so no reroll. Yeah, that, that's that's good. Yeah. I'm ready. So uh, okay. three attacks hitting on fours, and I hit with two. Two trolls and a one. And uh, actually, I need to look some. So I think it, is it rolls of wound sixes or killing blow? Is that killing blow on on, on six? Up? So that's the wound. Two wounds. Okay. Wound, yeah. So I have a lance, so I'm plus two or plus yeah plus two strength on the charge. A killing blow lance. Uh, it's. The Cloak of Twilight gives him the killing block. Okay, great. I'm ready. So, uh, anyway. Uh, yeah, so I'm base strength four, so I'll be strength six. Two up. Uh, one killing blow. 
but you get wards against that, so it doesn't really matter. So okay. two wounds against here comes, your Here comes the Phoenix ward guard. of four up. Yeah. Two nothing. of them. One guy dies, yeah. and then the other guy, heavy armor, nothing. And then ward You want to get heavy armor against strength six. Yeah, he just died. Oh, I wouldn't. All right, so well, two you got died. Well, you got the four up ward save. You, made, you rolled a four. So he, he survived on his ward save. Right, but yeah, I should have never rolled the second dice. No, no, you well, you, it was two wounds. Because I would have. It was two wounds. Right. I, I'm arguing against myself. So I rolled one dice for the first guy. Yeah. Didn't get my four up ward right. versus the killing blow. Well, then I rolled yeah. Then I rolled a three, which should have been the only roll that I got against that. And that's a fail. And then I rolled a ward. Do you see right, what I'm saying? What I, the way I saw it. Okay, I'll take it. You, you I only two, lose you one guy. You two wounds, and you okay, roll I'm one ready. die for a killing blow, which both of them just okay, get a ward. Now you're attacking from the bad. rear, so there's no depth of ranks, right? Uh, right. You don't get So I have two guys that. attacking back. Uh, it should be three, because if I'm right here, you get. Oh, yes, that's right. Maximized. You don't. Three. You don't peel off. Exactly. Okay. No, no hits. Loss. All right. Wait, do they get re rolls? Because they've always strikes first in a higher initiative now. Doesn't matter. We both have always strikes first. Yeah. It cancels. We still have the always strikes no first roll. Yep. Yep. It just cancels. It just the cancels their. It yep. cancels the reroll because of. That's it. So um. So I have uh, a charge in the in the rear. Uh -huh. A wound, and then you have your three ranks. Banner BSB. Oh my my horse. You're right. Oh, my horse. horse. <laughs> my horse will attack. He will miss. <laughs> Um, you have so you're sitting on two wounds, uh, no, one a wound. rear charge and a wound. One wound, right? one wound and a rear charge, yeah. yeah. So three. Uh, and then you have three ranks and, uh, well, I, I, yeah, I'm not going to matter. Banner, BSP. Banner, BSP. Okay. All right. So uh, I lose by, by, uh, no, you have to, you have to, yeah, you have to have like, so I lose by two? Yeah, that was weird. Why is that guy good? You should have one casualty. Yeah. Charge. Charge and the rear? Two. Charge and oh, a rear. Oh, and a rear. Okay. So I lose by one. That matters. And he's got nine leadership, right? Yeah. Okay. Oh, a oh, ten. Oh, so, uh... Yeah, uh, he's, the question is, do I want to chase after him? <laughs> right? Well, you'll be facing that way. and be backwards. Oh, I have hatred. Right. Yeah. Oh, well. Would that have made a difference? Uh, I get to... I actually would have gotten to re-roll to hit. Okay. Might have caused another wound. <laughs> that could matter. Oh, oh, that's weird. Do I want to chase well, this guy? Ten. So you would have still failed anyways. Because he has a, a musician. So even if you killed one more guy, it wouldn't matter. Yeah, I, I'm going to pursue. Okay. Let's see what happens here. I roll three dice. Okay, I'm ready. Troll, so that's a ten. Nine. Oh, nine. So here it comes. And I get a three. Oh, now you're facing the wrong way. Yeah, it doesn't matter though, because I'm I'm not gonna charge this turn. So uh, you turn around and I still three think inches. I'm better off trying to uh I'm yeah. just gonna do one of these here. Yeah. Well you, yeah, okay. Right. Yeah, I'm just gonna do this. Yeah, that's because I'm gonna it's turn crazy. around. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's keep going. Here? Oh yeah, them. Uh, so they have two attacks each. Uh, so the warlocks have extra hand weapon? Uh, no, they just have two attacks on their profile. Oh, are you attacks. kidding me? Yeah. What? Oh, my gosh. Uh, oh, these guys are amazing. Oh, my gosh, seriously. Hey, there's two wounds all, already. Oh, wow. And then these both hit. Okay. And uh, Murderous Prowse, get to reroll that. Hatred? Oh, uh, I, they all hit. Murderous Prowse will be wow. reroll the wound, but they didn't uh, What? Pass, so. And these guys don't have any two armor, wounds. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I am strength, uh, I am strength. Oh, no, they have a six up. I'm strength You're strength four? four? Hold on, they have the <laughs> they number get, four they, on their profile. Yeah, they get to attack simultaneously, though. They have, they should have always strikes first as well. No, I, I get it, but <laughs> the point I'm making is the warlocks have they're, strength they're four. They're also in rare. Reason. How many points are those warlocks? Uh, five of them is... They're like 23 points They're 25 points apiece. Oh, that's pretty expensive. So they're 125 points. Yeah, apiece. but they're, hold on, they have strength four, two attacks on their profile. I just, I just would like to mention in passing that that's the like same that. profile for those two stats as Chaos the Warriors. They uh, they yeah, the spells are great. And they have uh, Soul Light. And, but that if they, if they miscast, too, right? if they miscast, well, in, they only lose D3 wounds. Yeah, 
Here it comes. So I need to kill both of these guys. Yeah. That's basically what's happening. So, uh, so fours. Still four. Yeah. So. Yeah. With both. Right. And four ups to win. One. Uh, so I have four up ward. Yep. Well, no, you get armor sleeve too. Uh, I don't know if they have one. Rounds that you always have. One. They have arm. Well, they'd have a six up for being cavalry. Okay, so now they get a six up. <laughs> troll face. What? <laughs> Stupid troll. So you lose. Yeah, I'm. I'm and pissed. I'm gonna overrun. Oh yeah, totally, dude. Well, there's two guys. I'm gonna overrun. Yeah, do it. Three d six. Oh yeah. Ten. Ten so right oh, into the other bolt thrower. Yep. <laughs> I like it. You just took away a whole round of shooting that you could have. That is not awesome, guys. So turning the phoenix probably would have been the better move. That was kind of a... There, actually. Yeah, well, I thought I thought the 12 shots from the bolt throw... Could have gotten better with your those guys. Yeah. Well, the, the negatives to me were, were a big deal. It wasn't there. Really doing it. So this will go away at least now. Because it's Sean's turn now. Yep, that's true. So, uh, I have to read this real quick. Any enemy unit within 12 inches of the target at the start of their following Stupidity. turn... Stupidity. Good. Stupidity. Stupidity. For them. Uh, they make it on the Any enemy unit within 12 inches of the target, including the target itself. Oh, really? Yeah. Enemy units, too. They, they yeah, make it with a seven? Yeah, enemy of me. Oh, okay. So, did they did they make it? They did. And it was, it, it was on it, them, right? It. Yep. Uh, well, they're not moving, so it doesn't matter. And they're, yep, you're good. So you, okay. you did all that. All right, well, uh, let's, do, let's do charges. It's fake. Pyrite. Watch. Yeah, I don't have any charges. No charges, all right. Silly. Oh, oh, they're they're trying to get me to charge here. No, we're not. Uh, yeah. Oh, we're let's just move three inches and be in the same boat next turn. <laughs> Rally <laughs> here. The they, they make rally. it. Yeah. Fantastic. And so, uh, uh, I think that's it. Would have been or would be about 23 yeah, as well. Oh. I couldn't have made it. All right, where'd you move there, Sean? What happened? He's busy. He's doing work while we're trying to play. Well, he uh, turned these guys around. Just kind of kept everything. Moved the the archmage Thank into you. that. Sorry unit. about that. I didn't know oh, you no were problem. Recording. Uh, and then she's just facing that way. Probably going to try and shoot that guy. Yeah. Like. Absolutely. And then the phoenix came all the way over here, which I don't like. And the sky cutter is coming for this bolt thrower. Yeah, well, the damage is already kind of done, and the sky cutter has two wounds on it already. Yeah. So I may end up being a losing proposition there. So, right. um, okay. Magic, then. Clean that up. Yep, magic, and I, I'm ready. I'm ready to go. Three and so three, three, six. Three. Oh, and, and you I got channel. a channel with awesome. a six, and I roll my channel, which I don't get. So six dice to three dice. You want me to pause here for a yeah, minute? Please do. Mason's here with popcorn. Oh, that's kind of like nice. Yeah. <laughs> All right, All right ready? Uh, here comes magic phase. Okay. So um, I'm going to start beefing up my sea guard. Okay. Beefing so up the sea guard. Let's them, try it. Uh, let's do earth blood. Earth blood, which is five up regen. Oh, I'm sorry. Hold on a second. Okay. Uh, hand of glory on a ten up. That's hand from of the glory. Arch mage okay. For a ten. Looking needs a six. That's just a six. Oh wow. So uh, I just barely. So made you it have three more dice. Four. Three, and then this one. Oh, great, because you channeled. Ooh. Yep. Um, and Hand of Glory does what for them again? Sorry. It gives them plus D3 to four of their stats. Weapon skill, ballistic Ooh. skill, initiative, and movement. Oh, I don't care. Okay. Yeah, okay. have it. All right, fantastic. So they have that. So roll the D3. Then D3, yes. yes. They get plus three, three to nice. all those stats. Very nice. Okay, and uh, going to do Earth Blood. That's the five up regen. So it's the five up regen. Okay. Uh, same unit, then. Okay. Um, and they definitely get it. All right, I'm going to try and that's, get rid of that. That's cast on an 8, so that would yeah. be a uh, 14. Okay, I'm going to try and go for that. It's cast by the um, lore master. And, oh, and that, I can re-roll the dice, yeah. I keep forgetting. So 13, and I rolled it with a plus 4 to dispel, okay. so I got rid of that. No earth blood. All right, fantastic. So now you have your one dice to do whatever you want with. I do. I'm doing apotheosis on a 5. That's okay. the high magic one. You got it. Oh, and I get plus 1. Oh, it's auto fail on a 1. Yeah, unfortunate. Okay. That's it. Let's uh, keep it rolling because okay. I'm going to do keep my roll. Uh, shooting phase. Shooting phase very fast. Okay. Okay, uh, reaver bow from what's her face. All right. Shoot those guys. Here it comes. Twos. Three hits. Strength uh, plus one, so f uh, five. Four. Five. Yeah, okay. I think she has four. 
Okay, so, so two. two dead. Uh, yep. Uh, uh. Uh, I have no more shooting on them. You're welcome to do your thing. Okay. Uh, now these guys have three in the front rank, seven Oop. plus half is. I think they're uh, uh, out of range of the 12. BSB there, so they're gonna they're gonna flee. Awesome. How far? Ten. Okay, great. So, <laughs> so back where they were. Swoosh. Right? Yep. Over there. That looks about right. All right. Um, sea yeah. guard on the witch elves, looking for. Um, Threes, yeah, they didn't move. Okay. So threes and fours. That's a lot. Whoa! That's six. That's six. Okay. Yeah. Awesome. Oh no! Come on. I go. will take it. Um, and now this gal shooting one arrow at this uh, the Lord on oh, Dark sure. Steed. Miss. She misses. <laughs> uh, sky cutter on the bolt thrower. Okay. One. Need sixes. Six. Nothing. All right. Okay. And uh, we have only this for close combat. All right. So, so I'll uh, go ahead and do mine. Go for fours it. Fours and fours. One hit. No wound. Okay. So here's my. Oh, sorry. Four attacks for the guys. Four attacks for the guys, and they are poisoned, but they have hatred, so they will re-roll these ones that missed. Did you give me some popcorn? It's on that oh, that's for me. Okay. And then Thank these so three much. hit, and now we have uh, uh, forced wound, which three wounds. At minus one, so they're gone, mm -hmm. and uh, I will How overrun. Many? Three wounds at minus one. Oh, then they die. Uh, so overrun for seven. All right. So just right. yeah, cool. Alrighty. So my turn then. Woo! Uh, charges the. I was gonna charge the silver helms again. <laughs> well, I don't want to flee. Okay. Uh, the witch elves, whoa, are gonna <laughs> attempt to charge the the sea guard. Yeah, that's really where you need to go. And uh, then these guys, I don't know if they can really complete a charge as is, so they're just gonna have to probably move. I think they hit, I'm gonna have to take the test though to make because <laughs> I could declare a charge and they're frenzied, so I pass. And uh, yeah, uh, the 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 warlocks. The warlocks will charge into the flank of the sea guard as well. Okay. Okay. I'm ready. All right. Uh, do you want to stand and shoot? Oh, I do. Okay. Far. No problem. Eat that popcorn. Well shot. Minus one for the Minus stand and one. shoot. So fours and fours. Oh man! Look at all those. <laughs> look at all those. Crazy. Where it's gonna hurt. Not gonna be much left to make contact. That was fantastic. Wow. Six that was. again. It's all right. Oh, it's all just a Hellebron delivery system. <laughs> Is she the only one that needs to make it into combat? No, I mean the, the rest of them would do good too. But yeah, it'd be as long as she gets there, it's fine. Huh? <laughs> it's true. All right, so let's see if I even make this charge now. I don't even know what I need right now, but I'm gonna roll it. Six. So there's an uh, 8 plus 5, so that's uh, 13. I'd be surprised if that didn't make it. Yep, yep easily. In. Oh, sorry. So uh, I'm just going to want you to take your wound marker there. Yep. And we'll move them in. So I have to stay an inch away from your unit. Over there. So I'm going to end up like that without uh, the ability to maximize because of having to stay an inch away from you. Huh. Okay. Well, well, yeah, I guess technically you should be an inch away from your own unit, uh -huh. so I should be oh, able to yeah. max up like that. And then the Hydra can't fail, so, unless you're fleeing. Oh, no. Well, okay. you're going to roll your charge, and then you can, oh, obviously you'll make it, and then he has to test to rally. He doesn't, he did. No, he, no, he I already rallied. rallied. last turn. Oh, okay, fine. Yeah. They're not fleeing. He, ra he rallied. Uh, so the, uh, the Warlocks, there's gonna uh, be like, they're going to get in on a 12. The count is up to six. <laughs> six pieces of popcorn have not made it. I wanted to see, uh, the majority of your unit looks like I'm in your flank, not your rear, so they will go over here, like so. Mm, no, it's based on me for that. Oh, right, but, okay. So, so you are in the rear. Oh, all right, then rear it is, sorry. My bad. And that's a big the... deal, because that gives you plus two to your yeah. results. Okay, so uh, other movement and such, we got the rallying here, which they do, so they're going to rally and then be able to move. Because they're jerks. He's so dumb. Just like that. And then the 
Executioners, they're gonna march. So, oh, sorry, we'll be right. All right. So he rallies. He's fast, Cav. He can move. What's that? You would have failed when he started running for his own I think it was just you run away from like the biggest. Well, no, that's in the initial thing. I don't know. Maybe. Well, he did it that way. It made sense. It made sense. So. I, I, I'm pretty sure everything just goes to Now the this, by the way, for is people for watching, is for the handmaiden who's here. So I have an archmage and a handmaiden in a unit of 18 Lothern Seaguard. When's the magic? Magic, let's yeah. do it. Six and one. Oh, terrible. Worst combination you can have. Yep. Except like a two and a one, I guess. Two and a one actually is worse. Seven and a two. Channel. None. A three and a no two. Channel. It's nothing. Seven dice. I'm doing fine with just thumb. Yeah, he actually one. has been doing fine. Just spelling all my stuff. That's why you take a wizard. Alright, um, let's see here. How many more wounds is your one character at? Just one. one, the handmaiden. Wow. Uh, I'm going to do glittering robe onto my witch elves. Okay. Make sure I'm in range here, which I am. Goes off on a nine, so five on the two dice here. Okay. Which I get. Just barely. Okay. So, that's gonna so you need a nine? I needed a nine. Okay, then I'm going to throw three dice at it. Okay. Should I throw two? two. That's interesting. Two statistically. Two, I need a six to do it. I need a five to do it. I'll throw two dice at it. And fail with a four! That was the worst thing that could possibly happen for you, by the way. Yeah. Always the worst. This is so bad. See what this does again. Let's see. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-twenty-two, forty-twenty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-twenty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen, forty-fifteen, forty-sixteen, forty-seventeen, forty-eighteen, forty-nineteen, forty-twenty, forty-twenty-one, forty-two, forty-three, forty-four, forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven, forty-eight, forty-nine, forty-ten, forty-eleven, forty-twelve, forty-thirteen, forty-fourteen,
I, I'm like uh, so wanna, efficient at that now. Skull I'm like 22 there. guys off, not a problem. Here's, I got this. Here's a lookout, sir, for that guy. Because he's not the wizard. Oh, he oh one! So he takes a strength what? 10 hit, which he get, takes a wound yeah. from. And assuming it doesn't say no saves of any kind, he has the uh, armor destined to his a 4 up ward. Okay. Which he fails. So he takes a wound. Wow. So I need two skull dice then. One for each of my casters. And now, uh, on a. On a uh, one, two, or three, the wizard will just get sucked into the into the void. Wow. She's good. Oh, <laughs> that would have been the best. So a wound on each of them, and I, I thinned my executioners down quite quite a lot. Awesome. <laughs> I might add, that got is ri rid of more executioners than Phoenix Guard. Yeah. yeah. How many points are Phoenix Guard? Like 14? Yeah, 14. The executioners, I think, are 12. So oh, probably okay. didn't work out too well for me, right. but you know what? It's fun. Oh, oh wow. Now they're not quite as scary to charge. Awesome. So. Now I gotta do is survive this. That's it. Oh, survive yeah. that you're one not, thing. Yeah, you're not doing that. <laughs> <laughs> no All I gotta do. I'm right. feeling really hopeful right here. Okay, this could so, happen uh, for me. This guy's gonna Oh, we didn't do the Hydra's Thunder Stomp. You oh, you thunder don't get it now, against cavalry. Yeah. Alright. Um, That's right. Six shots at this now. Okay. Wow. Sky cutter. Sad. Four hits. Sky and cutter. Sad. Only one wound. Wow. Fantastic. So a six up. Six to save. Four becomes a six. Nope. Nope. So it takes another wound. Three wounds. Three wounds that it's taken, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. This yeah, I don't know why I didn't get this that. thing needs a three. Okay. Toughness is six. Well, missed. Wow. Like one a boss. Misses. Uh, so then the them they okay. uh, they moved in multiple shots. But if they shoot guy. her in the back and kill her so multiple with shots. poison bolts, Minus that one. would be the best. What? <laughs> Fours. Uh, oh, three. only three. Only three hits. Only oh, that's three. average. Two, or one wound, rather. One wound. Okay. and oh, But it's minus, minus two. one. Minus one. Minus two. two. Yeah. Okay. No, it's minus one for armor piercing, but it right. doesn't matter. She only has a six. Oh, oh that's rat sack. Okay, so. I don't approve of that. Let's do some. Just thunder down. My name is Sean, and I don't approve of that. <laughs> let's, uh, uh, there it goes. Let's start awesome. with this here. Oh, and, uh, okay, let's do it. Yeah. Um, just because it's cinematic, I don't know if this is good or not. I'm gonna, Hellbron's going to challenge. Oh. oh, yeah, I was definitely going to challenge. I accept with... Okay, <laughs> champion... Accepts the challenge of Hellion. Well, I mean, we have um, we have what's it called? Okay, so what we've got is we've got uh, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen witch elves, and Hellebron, right? Yeah. And that's it. That's all you have on your side. Yep. Okay, I'm ready. Well, Let's do okay. it. Uh, well. Well, um, we kind of all. Why don't you do yours? Because it okay. always I'll strikes go, first I'll go all around. First and, and okay. So she has so four attack explain. base. Four attack okay. base. Paired weapons. She's frenzied and she has witch brew, which gives her an additional attack when she already has frenzy. Okay. Um, which I actually need to look at her other uh, her other things that that she has. She has the three, the same three, uh, or all three of like the the, the witch elf things. So. Uh -huh. Yeah, so the Rune of Cain is gives her this extra D3 attacks, okay. which is going to be three. Okay. And um, then Cry of War doesn't matter because you don't care about fear tests from me, and then the Witch Brew is plus two attacks for okay. the thing. I'm so, uh, she, Here it is, comes. Uh, she is... Weapon skill? Weapon skill a lot. Like, uh, yeah, and and we, we want to know. So seven. Still seven. Okay, so she's looking for threes. Looking for threes, and she I have hatred. So I will get rerolled. Okay, whereas got you won't. Right. <laughs> I think the champ's gonna take her out. I don't think <laughs> so. How many wounds does she have again? Uh, she has three wounds. All right. She's got it. Yeah. The champ. Champ is like. <laughs> I didn't convert any of those. Oh well, one of them actually. So there's okay. her hits and the strength ten. Okay. So two ups. Now what? What and, gives them strength ten? Uh, she has the the paired weapons give her strength ten. All right. And this is killing blow or something? Uh, like no. It's just. Oh no. To, They're straight so, 10, so minus a lot okay. to your armor save. So I've taken uh, uh, seven, seven wounds. wounds. So, you okay. get your, so you get your parry saves. Oh, I do, don't I? <laughs> <laughs> make, make, make 10 parry saves. No, right the uh, Sea Guard have spear and shield. Oh, That's okay. So parry. they just get the extra rank so, when they yeah. get charged. So I've taken seven wounds on the Plus champ. Miles, right? Okay. Right, so, so let's uh, just gently... Oh, wait. Banner. Yeah, here's our champ. Yeah. 
Well, I'll just take one out of the bag. Yeah, you may as well. We, you know, you don't here it comes. Here. So, uh, one, one, one wound. Okay, let's see. Uh, oh, if I do a wound, that'll be the best. I know she has. I will accept amulet. this. Well, you have your scaly skin. I do have the scaly skin that she has. I think she has a four up in bone from this uh, annual thing that she has. Well, I'll just make the scaly skin. Oh no, that's a different thing. Yeah, so I just have my five up scaly skin. It's just straight okay. three, right? Yep. Right. Awesome! Yeah. One wound! Take it, Helbron! <laughs> That's totally worth it. 21 points. That's awesome. <laughs> I accept <laughs> this. The too. Oh, well. the it doesn't really matter. She had uh, something here. No, <laughs> yeah, it's not. Whatever. Uh, then uh, the witch elves. So... And all those excess wounds count against the unit on that. Yeah. Well, for a combat race. Yeah. Uh, so we've got one, two, three, four, five. Technically, that back rank would slide over too. Right, so it would be 10. Uh, but in the front rank, they have. Three attacks each? Witchbrew. Oh, Witchbrew, you're another one? Yeah. Oh my god, is it four each? I think so. <laughs> well, the back rankers only get one. They only right? get one, right. But the front rank is uh, enough. Yeah, so they have one attack and they. Is that with poison? They have two hand weapons, so. Yeah, they have poison as well. <laughs> so, uh, so I'm going to get five that have. Four attacks for one an attack, an extra hand weapon. So twenty. Yeah, so twenty okay. and twenty-five. Right. So there's here it goes. Five, ten. Counting the dice. Okay, Wait, here it goes. Oh, 25, sorry. Twenty-five, okay. Uh, and the witches are weapon skill uh, Well they're not four. five. So they're four. Yeah. So four is so with and hatred. Fours. I get hatred rerolls too. More chances. Uh, and poison. And poison, right. Yeah. So Wow. So there's five wounds already. Okay. And then these get to re-roll. Some more poisons. More poisons. Oh, God. And now these are uh, strength three oh. and armor piercing because they have the razor standard. Okay. So fours. So there's... Uh, 8, 10, 12, 14 wounds oh my God. at minus 14 one. wounds. 14 wounds at minus 1. 6 up saves. Yep, because shield and light armor. Yep. So 6s. Made 2. Alright, about average, roughly. Yep. So how many? 16 wounds? It was 14. 14, 14. So, 12. so 12. Yep. 12 are dead. Ugh. Okay. Got it. Okay. And am I hitting back now? Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, I do have my my oh, Yeah, go ahead. So four attacks for them. Right. So uh, two hits, uh, hatred. Four hits. Well, you get to re-roll the ones. One, I one, do get to, one, I do get to re-roll them because of murderous prowess. That is four ones on four oh, dice. Murderous prowess is re-roll. Re-roll one. ones to wound. Oh, re-roll ones. Yep. Okay. <laughs> There's two more ones. <laughs> one wound from them. All right. <laughs> uh, I'll just make that save now. Five fails. One guy dies. Yep. Uh, okay. So where are we? Uh, your attacks. Okay. Whatever fantastic. You left, right? So um, you've got. Uh, I have the wizard. She's cut the same as uh, the rank like and I said, file. I should have had. With... Technically, if there's like the okay. end rank and only. And then her, so. the uh, handmaiden. Where are you, lore master? Handmaiden actually has more attacks. Only two attacks. A hero level character. That's right. Don't heroes normally have three? No. Yeah, they'd have three. For a caster, usually two. Well, handmaiden, no. The, the, the health wizards are like... Six quick silver shot. Hold on. Strength four. Even my supreme source is only one. Yeah, she is not that awesome. Quick to fire. All right. Uh, so here we go. So let's do the handmaiden. Why not? Two attacks, two misses. Mm -hmm. And then rank and file, just one in the front row because the champ fought, right? Champ died, uh, but one would, one would pile in. Right. One would, one would, would it? Place. So yes. one, two, three. Yes. Well, technically she would have moved to the end to fight game. her. So there's still only two regular guys and then ten. Like the so I've got twelve attacks back. Two, four, well, six. Well, you get... You get Okay, because four ranks times three guys, three guys, is that what you're saying? Well, you get your supporting from everyone else, too. Even behind the You get your full supporting attack. I understand. So, yeah, I'm and counting one rank. extra you rank. Get four ranks. Oh, I do. Because yeah. uh, your martial prowess and. Uh, yeah, absolutely. And, and, and spears. spears. Yeah. So, 
I'm going to have them all go forward into the witch elves. That's probably my best bet right now. So here it comes. Fours and fours is what I'm looking for. No buffs. That oh, a that's a lot twos. of ones and twos and threes. Yeah. Yep. Wow. So lady good. averages. So just look at the two piles. That, there you go. Miss, not miss. Fours. Uh, yeah. So four wounding hits. Five ups. I made one. So three go down. All right. Well, that was not awesome. So yeah, let's do the horses, and then that's it. Two attacks. Two hits. The rear, because you would have gotten rid of his rear, possibly. You'd only have six. Oh yeah, that's right. That's true. Okay. So two wounds. Uh, one. One wound. Five. Makes it. Okay. All right. Uh, if you'll allow me, I'd like to do combat res. Yeah, sure. Yeah. So this is what you got. Yeah. You got, and I'm going to do it by number showing on the dice because it's okay. going to be that high. All right. Twelve wounds from the witch elves. Yep. One from the locks. And then seven mm -hmm. from Hellebron on the champ. Yeah. Right. And then one from the um, warlocks. One from the warlocks. Thank you very much. Yeah. And uh, hold on. Plus you charged, so that's plus one. And, I have and a then rear. you also have a rear. It's not cumulative though. Char oh yeah, you it Charge is and actually a yeah. and a rear, so that's two. I just don't two. have two charges. And uh, you have a banner. Do you have a BSB in there? Nope, just the banner. And uh, you don't have a rank now. Nope. I did manage to get you down there. Yep. Um, and I think that's it. <laughs> I think that is it. Okay, so your combat res is only twenty-four. Only twenty-four. All right. Only twenty-four. All right, I think you got and a good My combat here. res. My combat res. Okay, so now I have no ranks. In fact, all. By the way, it's just like the heroes so you standing get full ranks here because he's no. not five strong. Yeah, you get your full ranks. You right, get but your... they're dead. Oh, you yeah. You can peel them off <laughs> oh, yeah. the thing. They're actually <laughs> right. they're literally actually all dead. lying okay, on the yeah. ground. You're right, they're all dead. How many guys are left? Right. Yeah, what's left? So, I did 12 I have, wounds? I have a banner. 13 wounds, rather? Yeah. Well, you, yeah, you have a banner. 13 wounds would not have killed the command. No, so I, I do have, have a banner, banner, and I have four wounds yeah, on the rich Yeah. Losing 12. And I, did I get one on Hellebron? You did, yep, so another did. one there, so five. I, yeah. but, and by the way, incidentally, the one wound on Hellebron from the champ, I'm good. counting that as the, the moral, moral victory. <laughs> so on that level, I've won this game already. Right, this perfect. is a done deal. There you go. <laughs> perfect. It's terrible. Be careful who you do that with because some people will find it very obnoxious. Maybe it is objectively very obnoxious. Okay, so yeah, so obviously I need uh, insane courage yes. to make it. With a reroll. With a reroll. Let John roll. Yeah, I rolled four, four ones. ones. Oh, boxcars! Now, now, average should say you rolled double ones right here. Nope. Nope, a seven. <laughs> uh, well, my, my witch elves have to come after you. Right. And the you should warlocks, pursue with both. The warlocks, no, the the warlocks the are going to attempt to uh, restrain. What? Yeah. Why not? Why should I have them go after you? Because you're gonna, that's... Because you're going to go this way because oh. of the center-to-center -center thing. Okay. So, I mean, I don't know. If the witch elves don't catch you, I don't really care. Okay, I'm gonna, I think you should do it. The witch elves are going to probably just hit your other yeah, unit. Okay, okay. here it comes. Six. Witch elves, six. six. So that they caught you. All right. And I go into your other unit. And the locks right. tested to restrain. They made it. Okay. Well, Can I, I form two? So all right, let's do Hydra. Hydra's in the mood for some venison. Well, you get to go here. first. Kill the Hydra I do. Posthumous. That, yeah. would be, that would be fantastic. Okay. Uh, misses all around. What's your weapon? Your weapon skill is probably like five. Yeah. You get rerolls. It? It's four. You get What's your weapon skill? Four. But you have weapon. You have uh, always strikes first, yes. and I don't. So you get rerolls. Okay. Oh, and that's all hit. hits. Now Sixes to wound. Mm. Nothing. Still nothing. Horses go first. Yeah, yeah the horses get to kick Okay, first. sounds good. Yeah. Horses looking for fours. Oh, the horses are Sixes are to mad. wound. No, they rolled three sixes uh, to hit, though. All right, five plus my remaining wounds, or three plus my remaining wounds of five. I only hit. I only hit with four, and I only wound with two. All right. So that's two dead. Yeah. Right? Oh, that's yeah, right. You Sorry. Four. And you okay. made. Both wow. Of them. Awesome. So just minus one. Yeah. Charge versus a banner. Actually, oh yeah, that's true. Right? And I'm stead. Oh, I don't have a rank. Yeah. Oh, I do actually, have a yeah, musician. you fled your banner. Banner died last time. Right, so I did win by one. Yeah. All right. Here that's it comes. True. Seven. Makes it. Okay. Well. Yep. You're gonna call him then. 
Yeah, I am, actually. <laughs> oh, and by the way, John's not coming out of the blue with that while the camera's off. It's like, yeah, I think, I think it's a mop-up But operation. then I was, I was a jerk, and I was like, but I want to do the Hydra combat. Yeah. <laughs> let me see how bad it is. No, let's keep playing. Yeah. Let's see if I can kill you to a yeah. man. Yeah. <laughs> Fantastic. Some people like that. That's great. Yeah. Oh, well, that's true. A bit, the better end. I, had, I remember being in a tournament, it was a Skaven player against my lizard men, and I had like my block of source Service warriors lizard, in the middle. You get points and it matters. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. you should play Okay, it. well. If you're doing a tournament, you should play anyway. it all the way because... I don't think I've been in a tournament for over 10 years. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't think I've, I've gone. I've never played in a I used to go to cho like rogue like traders to try and win best painted. Oh, yeah? You know? Yeah, I actually have a bunch of them stored away here somewhere. <laughs> you know? Well, it's not hard when, you know, people aren't trying. Yeah. yeah. Well, I mean, I'm sorry. Did that sound bad? <laughs> no, no, it's true. No, it's true. <laughs> but it's true. Most people come and they're, they're not like trying to make their army yeah, look special. And, really you know, I always enjoyed painting. So anyway, so uh, okay. Well, thanks a lot, John. Let me get uh, this tripod set up and we'll do a redux. Hey, and folks, thanks for tuning in. Uh, do want to remind you that uh, you can commission an army through us. You can pick up. We usually have multiple armies. <laughs> Typically at least 5 to 15 armies for sale at any given time. Um, you can also sell your army on commission with us. Uh, if you do that, I recommend, it's kind of an ad hoc thing where we set up the deal of who's going to get what and, you know, how it goes down. Um, but if you, I'm looking for a connector thing. Um, and then also you can trade in your stuff for some instant gratification and that Guys, that is really, really, really the way to go. So how it works is you send your list to store at bluetablepainting.com. And, and if you send it to the wrong email, it doesn't matter. We'll forward it. And with your list of stuff, and then um, you'll get what's called a tag. So it'll, it's this thing you can print off. You put it in the box with your figures. And um, the tag... Uh, so when we open the box, da -da, we see which option you've checked for type of credit that you want. And then you, we just give you your coupon code for the web store. You go in, you shop it. You have six months uh, to pick up your stuff. and Well, six months to shop it and use your coupon code. And we got new stuff coming in every day. I just did a deal for three 40K armies uh, over New Year's. And uh, so those should be coming soon. Yeah, we actually have quite a few armies coming in. And uh, last I knew, Dave was going to put up about 120 listings. So we've got a lot of new stuff coming in. I have this box here. But all That is, um, so by the way, this is, this is what a tag looks like. I want to make sure there's no confidential information. So this uh, client has chosen Web Store Credit 160. And we give you a little bit to help with your shipping, too. So he get a $170 web store credit. But because most things are about 50% off, uh, conservatively, he'll get at least $250 worth of stuff uh, retail for that web store credit. So it's a great program. I love it. It's easy as pie. Uh, we usually ship out once or twice a week. And uh, as the program heats up, I'm hoping to get that down to, uh, to every day. Anyway, um, off we go. All right, so uh, Redux. Yeah. Um, I'll go first because I'm oh, sure oh, you have more interesting things to say. Do I? All right. First off, I could have definitely played a stronger game. Uh, the High Elves have a lot of buffs, a lot of defensive stuff, and I, I didn't get it on the right unit at the right time. And I did have I did have the Banner of the World Dragon in the Phoenix Guard, and I'm not sure, but I think Hellebron's Strength Ten comes from a magic. Thing, right? Well, I never attacked the Phoenix Guard with them. Right, I understand, so, but it, with her, but, but yeah, they're magic, have a they magic are magic weapons, weapons, so you would get your two up saves against. Right, them. so a better tactic, tactically, it would have been better for me to get my Phoenix Guard into the Witch Elves. Well, but then the basically. Witch Elves would just be like, well, here's my, here's my zillion, 20 zillion right uh, poison attacks. So, but yeah. it would have been better than what happened with the Lothran Sea Guard. Like, yeah. let's move my high point costed, low armor characters into this unit that's about to be charged by the Witch Elves and this giant nightmare creature, so... Yeah, that's true. Not the best, not the best tactically played in terms of where I put my buffs and when and which units I paired up against which other, which other units. No pun intended. Go ahead. <laughs> there was a pun in there? I missed it. There was. Um, Witch Elves? 
Oh, which elves are which? Okay, which you, uh, okay. I'm with you now. I'm with you. All right, thanks. <laughs> Try and keep up. Well, what would, what would you? Is there any like LVP, MVP stuff like that? Oh, me? Uh, blah. Hmm. Because like personally, I, I would say things that you could have done differently. Like if you had the, the Frost Phoenix in the middle as opposed to flanking, would have yeah. been really nice because then. As soon as you get into combat with, say, those Phoenix Guard into the Witch Elves, then you can at least put that in there and, and, and get, get a Thunder Stomp, always right. strikes last, minus one strength. Really nice. Um, yeah. Yeah. Uh, there, there's a lot more I could have done to synergize. Yes, my army, I, would, sure. I would agree with that. Um, I would say the, like, those fast cap units, they were, prob they were worth their weight in gold. Oh, yeah. I couldn't get no rid of them. No pun intended. I didn't get rid of them. Because yeah. I used the Lord. Anyway. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, they were hard to get rid of. They can basically do whatever they want, just be jerks the whole game. Imagine if this army had more than just five of each. I would have oh, had. Absolutely. I would have had like probably two units of each, if not three Dark Riders. Yeah, it yeah. would have been. It would have been way, way worse. The like, Warlocks are was, great. Yeah, they're good. Well, and that is your level two because normally you want to take a two, four yeah. and a two. Yeah. So you have that dispel going on, and the Warlocks they're your level two. You know, you've got that backup for a dispel that you're not down yeah. to plus zero, you know, and get run over in the magic phase. Yep. Well, I got to tell you, if I had a chance to do it over again, I think I could definitely synergize this army better. And this yeah. is, I, I, it's a good high elf list. Uh, Paul actually texted me this list. Yeah, and, uh, I, th I, I think, he, I think he set you up to fail a little bit there. Did he? Yeah, it wasn't as good as, as oh, he could have done with the Well, with but had that's kind of what was in the army. I mean, I just left five silver helms and two Yeah, eagles, if you had just, you know? if you had done, like, the, yeah. all the silver helms uh -huh. with then, like, I think there's a, a character in there you could have used as a BSB to put the Banner of the World Dragon in the silver helms. Now you have yeah. a unit that has, like, a standing two up. Right. And the two up against all magical stuff. Right. Well, I, yeah, I could have, yeah, absolutely. And they're way faster. Well, all right, so maybe Paul can play this army against the Dark Elves. Maybe. You know. All right, that's what I think. Has to happen. <laughs> Do you have any other comments? No. I mean, it was fun, at least, for me. I don't know. Was it fun for you, Sean? <laughs> yeah, I had Did a good time. Did you have fun, at least? It was good. Okay. It was good. I love Warhammer Fantasy, and it's always interesting. And these are obviously two amazingly, uh, you know, armies with a good really good appearance yeah and so all right well folks thanks for tuning in we appreciate you coming by and um you know there's more to come in 2015 that's all i gotta say <laughs>